So, if your bum, ass, buttock or the moons are in the middle, why is it called the bottom? What is the linguistic mystery? And what are the origin of the word but? Hmm? Think? Tough, right? That's where the theory show comes into play. Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of the theory show. In this episode, you will be enlightened with some interesting and bizarre information about humans' knowledge and how everything around us has its own explanation and follows no trend, yet they make sense. So, as usual, without further waiting, let's dig in. Have you ever thought when the civilization was evolving and developing everything from an atom to infinite galaxies and from being born to being dead, from awake to sleep, ingestion to excretion, everything was given a significant name, which in some or other how makes sense now. But is or everything named right? Now let's think about your bottom. Why in the world you would call something being at bottom when it's clearly in the middle of your body? So what is the mystery or the linguistic mystery? Whenever you look at your body, your feet and your knees are either at the same level or below your bottom except some yoga posture. So did the human race fail to name a position of a body part? Well, there has been no clear answer for this anyway and not any company had a keen interest to fund the R&D for finding the origin. But it has to do a lot with your spine. While studying the anatomy of human body, the body is what from neck to hip, your hands and legs are additional appendages which are likely you can survive without. On another aspect, looking along the spine starting from the atlas which is lower part of your skull, straight line of the body runs only up to the bumps that is buttock, thus the bottom. Though there is no butt load of information on the fact of the origin of the butt, but it was historically used to define the capacity of wine held by this particular container, which was the maximum holding capacity which was placed at the bottom. Thus originated the word bottom. And from there originated various terms like buttload of information when you have so much to inform, buttload of crap when there was so much of nonsense. But this was not the end of the story. If you have watched my video on body shaming, if not you can watch it by clicking here, it will be made clear how having the girth was the symbol of healthy, rich, prosperous life. So the bigger the butt, the bigger was your pocket. But your butt is awesome. Without it, you would not look what you are. In fact, it's human butt that gives the human the posture, the right meaning, the right shape and that attracting look. Your bottom, the bum is made up of muscles called gluteus maximus and gluteus media which is muscle with layers of fat that provides cushion while you sit. And everyone favors the idea of having cushion to sit upon. Thus, the bottom becomes the butt or the butt becomes the bottom. Human race is filled of butt load of unrelated information. Is it or is it not? Well, that's up to you. As usual, thanks for watching. Don't forget to give us a big thumbs up. So if you like to consume such content and love the content, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon. And if you have such questions, do put them in the comment section below. So next time, we can turn off with your question as an episode. Till then, take care. Goodbye.